The cast of Suits did, in fact, have a surprise reunion on the Golden Globes. But things did get awkward when the actresses took the stage. But not as awkward as the head of Netflix laughing at a brutal Meghan and Harry joke. Welcome to Popcorn Planet. I am Andy Signor. And yes, there had been rumors that the cast of Suits, the newly popular again series starring Meghan Markle, would reunite for a Golden Globes appearance presentation and possibly even announce a new spinoff. Well, we got all the clips for you before we get to that very awkward reunion. Just wait a second. Before we get there, I got to start with host Joe Coy, who is a mixed bag at the bat at the top of the show. Uh, he says he only had 10 days to prepare. But he did get in a really good joke regarding Harry and Meghan. And better than the joke was the reaction to the joke, particularly from the head of Netflix here. Uh, I want you to watch this joke. Here we go. How great was Imelda Stolte in the crowd? Her portrayal of the queen was so good, Prince Harry called her for it and asked her for money. <laughs> Turns out Prince Harry and Meghan Markle will still get paid millions of dollars for doing absolutely nothing. And that's just by Netflix. Who's laughing there? Well, that is Ted Sarandos, the CEO of Netflix. <laughs> the CEO of Netflix laughing and acknowledging that, yes, they got paid to do nothing. I mean, that's amazing that they had that cued ready. <laughs> he catches himself like, oh, I shouldn't be laughing at this. <laughs> Uh, the Harry joke at the beginning, uh, the elder, uh, you know, the queen on the crown is just so good that he keeps asking him for money, but, and that's just by Netflix. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. I, 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 I say, I loved seeing that. So yes, uh, they got slammed in the intro. So how awkward if Megan was in fact there. And yes, there was a reunion. The two stars did show up and there is nothing more dramatic or anxiety inducing than waiting all night to hear that your category is finally arrived. Yes, yes, that's true. It's hard to imagine having to wait so long to see your show get that kind of recognition. Uh, I get it, because Suits had to take a long time to get uh, popular. They were there to present the best dramatic series, which, spoiler alert, went to succession, my favorite show in like the last 10 years. What a brilliant show. But anyway, just when you thought it was over, no. As I was watching live, which we were watching together, suddenly this happened. Actresses came out of the stage. <laughs> as he what does are you talking? <laughs> Don't worry, I'll explain it later. And oh, hey, guys. Moment, what? And for a moment, it's like, what? oh, hey, guys. It's like, whoa, she's going to be here. Whoa. Don't hey. forget nope. about us. Hope you didn't forget about us. Um, did you forget about us? What? No, 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 no. no. <laughs> sorry, not sorry to interrupt. <laughs> um, I do think they forgot about the nominees. Right, nominees, however, yes. Right? Let's go to the nominees. <laughs> And there I is mean, did they forget? That was the most awkward exchange ever. Like, why not have the full cast come out together and do it together? No, let's let the actresses wait in the back and then come out and surprise. Uh, and uh, it was just so awkward. Tell me, correct me if I'm wrong, chat, but that was just weirdly placement. And again, this guy, uh, Mike, is it in the, in the show, is with Rachel Zane, um, uh, the Duchess's. Uh, Megan's uh, character. Uh, they're supposed to be there. So it should be, you know, like she should be there. The cast there. Where's Megan? Uh, that's the big question. Well, the reason Megan's not there, apparently, according to our own co star, we don't have her number. You got to hear this clip. This is such a secret little diss, if you ask me. Here it is. All texting each other. Well, when it all came through, we were all texting each other. Yes, our text thread is insane right now. So it's very exciting. Who texted Megan and said, you got to come to the Golden Globe, Megan Marco? We don't have her number. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have her number. That sounds so like, a, yeah, we don't like her. She's not in our chat thread. <laughs> yeah, that's a it's, good one. We just don't. So hope she'll see. She'll watch. She she'll be, be happy that we're here. Regina, thank you for stopping by. She'll be jealous. She'll be pissed. What? I mean, 
And is it just me or do you sense a little bit? Listen to that. Listen to that again. Through, we were all texting each other. Yes, our text thread is insane right now. So it's very exciting. Who texted Megan and said, you got to come to the Golden Globe, Megan Marco? We don't have her number. <laughs> we don't have her number. We chose not to get it. I see. Now, look, there's a reality where I don't believe they have the number. It's true. She probably like unlists her number all the time and doesn't let any of these people have her number because she cuts them all, you know, see ya. Uh, but yeah. <laughs> and even he's just like, ooh, youch. All right. Yeah, that's a good one. We just don't. So hope she'll see. She'll watch. She she'll be happy play. that we're here. Ah, uh, sure. Do you think she was happy that they were? I think this was a bad look for Megan. This was a bad look for Megan to not show up. Uh, and I don't believe for a second that they didn't have a way to get to her. I don't believe that. No way. There's definitely a way you get to Ari Emanuel, WME. There's these actors have agents. The showrunner is a hugely popular showrunner right now. Like the head of creator of suits can get calls to Ari Emanuel if he wants to. And that to me says a lot. It says a lot. And we'll break that more down this week as we go through. I'm curious what your thoughts are, but it's a massive disc because well, it goes one of either two ways. It's a diss to Megan, which is very possible, or Megan's actually is dissing the cast yet again and not taking this opportunity. But that's just hard for me to believe that she wouldn't. This is such an easy way to go hobnob with Hollywood, to be at the Golden Globes. It really does feel like to me that she was she was blocked out, that she wasn't allowed to be there. Uh, because how do you miss that opportunity? And then all this press out there is not really in her favor. Uh, and and again, the, the headline out there is the fact that, yeah, they she was made fun of in front of all these Hollywood people. Uh, they both were for doing nothing. This is not the place you want that joke to happen. And it's not the place you want the CEO of Netflix. <laughs> They're like, yeah, pff, we know, we know. All that said, there was one cast member who had Megan's back. They asked her, and again, slight little diss here too, because look at this. All these rumors that Megan may come back to acting, would you guys team up again? You heard that rumor? Look how surprised he is. Yeah, well, I mean, no. She told you that directly. I think I think the truth is is that we Look made up him. a He's rumor like, because we wanted to ask you about it. Um and that's the truth, but but would would did she ask you about it? Because she's he's like, no way, we're, we're that's happening. Would you, like, would you ever team up again? I think Megan's a fantastic actor, so we'd be lucky to have her back in the industry, sure. I mean, he's gotta say that. He's gotta say that. He can't be like I mean, that'd be such a bad move right now to have your co-star who's like the love interest of your show. To, to, because you're you're kissing your own opportunities out the window to be in that show. It's important. Yes, 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 let's go. I'll do it Can again. Can we do a spinoff or something? Yeah, I'm ready. Mike and He's like, please pay me. I don't care who you stick me with. This dude's going to sell his soul to whoever he can. Rachel in Seattle. What happened? Yeah. Can we ever do a project together? All three of us? No, no, no. Megan's not <laughs> a three-way? <laughs> What is going on in this interview? It took a turn. Uh, anyway, at the end of the day, I think, yes, it, it's surprising it happened. Surprising the reunion happened. Uh, and uh, very interesting to see Joe Coy slash him. And most interesting for me to see <laughs> this, the CEO, the head cheese, the big boss at Netflix. <laughs> he's, he's uh, yeah, acknowledging that they just got paid for doing nothing. Uh, and uh, what an awkward... Could this be any more awkward? Why did they let the women out in the wings and then not have anything for them to do? And then the fellas are like, oh, you guys are joining us? Did they actually just uh, mad dad, like take off, sprint on stage to try to get involved? It was a very weird thing. Bring them all out in the cast of Suits. Uh, it was a very weird put together thing. And Megan clearly didn't get the invite. Do you believe? Now, here's what I want you to tell me in the chat. Before we get to the chat, I have a question for you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell. We're so close to 750,000 subs. Let's get there. Help smash the way. Uh, we have other coverage, too. Please watch our other non-royal coverage. You can head over to Popcorn Pl uh, Palace uh, over there. Hit the royal popcorn at the end. I'll put it here at the end. Click there. All our royal coverage there. But I want to know this answer. Do you believe that they didn't tell her? Do you believe that they don't have her number and they wanted her there? Or do you believe she was shut out? I'm curious. Did, did Megan make the choice to say no? Or do you th and, or do you really believe uh, this? And they, or do you think they shut her out? I want to know your thoughts. Megan chose, didn't want to be around this cast. Or no, the cast didn't want to be around Megan. Which is it? Tell me down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. We got so much more for you this week. So glad to be back in studio. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching here on Popcorn Planet. And stay tuned for more.